Hi guys, this is Astrid Reeves with Astrid's Art Studio, and I'm getting ready to paint my next painting. Hi there. <laughs> I'm playing with the camera angles today. So today I'm going to be working with uh, a purple color and gold and fluorescent pink, blue, and a light pinkish purple. So there's my base color, the white. I'm putting down white as a base color. And then the purple is the other base color. It's such a deep, rich purple. It's just absolutely gorgeous. I'm putting more white on the top. I want to divide the painting up into thirds. So two thirds white, one third purple, so that my painting is not half and half. So here I'm, I'm using the blow dryer and I'm going to spread those paints over the entire canvas. There I'm using the blow dryer to spread the, move the paint around and uh, that's just a fun way of doing it and it goes really fast. I'm blowing it out so till it drips over the edges and then that provides a nice base layer for the other colors that I'm going to put on next to move around down and create a beautiful pattern. In places where I don't have enough paint, I need to put more on. I have to make sure that there's enough paint for everything to move around smoothly and easily when I put the second layer on. So here I am smooth smoothing the sides and oops i just tripped white into my purple <laughs> oh well <laughs> i'm just gonna smooth everything out so make sure everything's evenly covered i gotta get that out of the way i don't want to get paint on my next canvas. Okay, so here I'm blowing it out just using my breath to spread the paint around because I don't want to mix the purple and the white just yet. So I need a little bit more controlled motion. And so that's why I'm blowing on it instead of using a hairdryer. Well, it looks like I don't have paint in my hair yet. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Just give it time. I'll get paint in my hair. Never fails. That purple is just a such a beautiful deep color. I love working with it. Okay, so now I'm getting ready to put down the colors. I'm going to put down a little blue first. Just going to lay everything down in a stripe across the where the two colors meet. Whoops. <laughs> Helps if I get more paint on the canvas than off the canvas. There's my pink pinkish purple. 
And now I'm going to do my hot pink. It's my fluorescent pink. Such a cool color. And I'm going to do my gold last. Okay, I've got all the paints down. Now I'm just going to put a little bit more white to blow over the other colors. You'll see what I mean in just a second. It's so exciting. I love this. Is my favorite part because you never know how it's going to turn out. I've got the colors down and I'm going to do the purple. Same thing on the bottom. And then I'm getting ready to use the blow dryer and just blow it all out. And you never know. There's no predicting what pattern is going to come out. There we go. I'm going to blow it this way first, the white over the colors first, and then the purple back the other way. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. Look how pretty that is. The dark purple against the white and the hot pink is showing through. And you can see a little bit of the gold. Oh my God, that is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I love it so pretty okay i'm looking at it and i don't really see much that i would want to improve in that 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 turned out really cool so i'm just going to put a little bit more purple on that corner cuz it's not enough paint there I like it to drip over all the sides evenly. As you can see, it's dripping in front there. Look at that cool pattern on the side. You know, it's just, it creates such a cool gallery wrapped canvas effect by having it drip over the sides with the different colors, you know, and uh, the purple is so dark, it almost looks black. You know, it's just such a deep, deep, rich color. Just beautiful. I'm really loving this painting. I love how it turned out. I love all the colors, all the different combinations the colors make when they mix together. You can see a little bit of the blue in there mixed in with the purple next to the pink. Just gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. I just wanna make sure everything's covered evenly so when it dries, you know, there aren't any bare spots or anything like that. Wouldn't want bare spots. <laughs> A naked painting. Oh, no. <laughs> and now I'm just getting rid of all the little drips. <clears throat> but it's going to continue to drip as it dries. And then I can always trim those off later. Looks gorgeous. So, guys, tell me what you think. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit subscribe and like, and let me know what you think in the comments below. I'm just going to finish uh, doing little touches here and there, making it look perfect. Thanks for watching.